graphic designers or GDs are a very important part of any project. This video explains how instructional designers should work with the GDs for ensuring success of any project. Let's get started. Generally the graphic designers are involved quite late in the project. In most of the projects the work of graphic designers start only after the storyboard is finalized. This is quite late for the graphic designers to provide any value addition. You should involve the graphic designers during the early stages of the project so that they can make their valuable contribution to the project. While working on any project, never ask a graphic designer just to follow the storyboard strictly. Motivate them to come up with creative ideas that can be implemented within the available constraints. In most of the projects the graphic designers are not allowed to directly interact with the clients. Let the graphic designers interact with the clients to understand their requirements. Unless they understand the client requirements properly, they won't be able to give app solutions. Whenever you create a project plan, keep enough buffer in it for creativity. It's difficult for the graphic designers to come up with creative solutions in projects with tight deadlines. At times the solution suggested by the graphic designers would not be proper or feasible. Remember that graphic designers are also humans. Don't reprimand them for failed creative ideas as this approach would kill their creativity. Graphic designers are creative people. Recognize the graphic designers who come up with creative ideas. This would encourage them to come up with better ideas for the project. In lots of projects, the instructional designers don't provide the graphic designers a walkthrough of the storyboard due to time constraint. This results in incomplete or incorrect understanding and later leads to delay in production. It's always a good practice to give a proper walkthrough of the storyboard before the graphic designers begin their work. Instructional designers are busy professionals and are required to keep multiple aspects of the project in check. Do remember that giving enough time to the GDs for interacting with you is also essential. Else, their doubts will not be resolved and you won't be able to benefit from their graphic designing expertise. On some projects, graphic designers are overloaded with work. This kills their creativity and they would be able to give only average output if you overload them with work. Sometimes, the graphic designers are afraid to share out-of-the-box ideas as they are not sure how it would be taken. If you want to enhance the quality of your projects, assure the GDs that it's okay to come up with different and out-of-the-box ideas. This brings us to the end of the video. Hope you liked it. You now know how as instructional designer you should work with the graphic designers to ensure success in every project. We would come up with more interesting and informative videos soon. Till then, keep learning and growing.